We're at the surface grinder today and I want to go over the coolant system that I set up for it. It's flood coolant. Here it is in operation with the grinding wheel off. I also have a spray gun that I can use for cleaning things off. Get all that grit off of there. On this surface grinder, which is the Brown and Sharp 618 MicroMaster Hydraulic, the coolant collects in the table, goes in behind the chuck. and then exits in two troughs. One there, and one on the other side. Right there. Any coolant that splashes on the column goes into those troughs. And any coolant that sprays inside the table guards, or even out here, collects down and goes that way. You can see outside the table, goes in the trough right here, back down. There it is running in that trough, and that one. Comes to the back of the trough, goes in the hole, and this is where things have to get interesting. Because even though I had a surface grinder set up for a coolant system, I didn't have a coolant system. So we made this. This is an acrylic fish tank from eBay. You see where we went down into the tank and that runs into a filter bag. There's the bag there. Get these bags on McMaster car. That's 100 micron mesh. It's just a mesh bag with a tie. Works really well. After the mesh bag goes down into the tank, it gets sucked back out. In here you can't see is a big aquarium pump that feeds this hose and that goes back up. To deal with the tramp oil there's a disc oil skimmer that goes into an oil water separator. Coolant goes this way back to be recycled or returned into the system and any tramp oil eventually goes out down here. Here's the skimmer in function. It dips down into the water. And oil sticks to the disc. Oil and water in this case. So any oil floating on the surface gets skimmed off on the wipers. But that brings coolant with it as well. And if you threw all of that away, you'd need to replace your coolant like crazy. So that collects here, down into the skimmer, and that separates the oil from the coolant, and the coolant is returned to the system. The capacity of this particular system is 15 gallons. And to keep it from ever smelling, I keep it circulating with two little aquarium pumps on the inside. 
here they are here Just little pumps got on eBay for a few bucks this one here and one over here that's plenty of circulation and because we're taking the tramp oil out and circulating we never have any smells and this coolant lasts a long time a year or more this particular mix is soluble oil water soluble oil I got this from McMaster car works really good there's water and a little bit of oil going in most of that oil is from the oil I use to treat my chuck. Nice clean cooling out. Alright, that's all I got for today. Thanks for watching. See you next time.